Haptics on a smartphone are one of those features that people either really focus on or choose to immediately ignore. For some, feeling the smartphone vibrate on taps can be annoying, but for others, they see it as just a waste of battery life. Then there are some people who just really enjoy a strong haptic feedback feature. Google is coming around to giving users the ability to adjust the strength of your Google Pixel 6 and Pixel 6 Pro's vibration motor. And in today's video, I'll be showing you how to adjust the vibration strength when receiving a phone call, when you get a notification, or those simple tap and touch feedback vibrations. I'm reading that Google has added this feature to Android L but I was unable to find it when checking my Google Pixel 4a. So this addition to Android is likely going to be device dependent due to hardware limitations. And then again, we could end up seeing these other devices get the updated settings option in a future update. I was, however, able to find these options on my Google Pixel 6 and suspect them being available on the Pixel 6 Pro as well. But let me know in the comments section below if you are seeing these sliders on any other devices. So we can take your Pixel 6 or Pixel 6 Pro and open up your settings application. And then you're gonna to want to scroll down a little bit until you see the sound and vibration option. Now we're going to scroll down again and we're going to look for and then tap the vibration and haptics option. And this is where we go if we ever wanted to disable our phone's vibration motor. And now it's a place to adjust the strength of the haptics as well. You can see we have three different sliders to adjust. This controls the vibration for whenever we receive a phone call. So if you wanted to lower the vibration strength whenever you receive a phone call, you can use this slider here. The same for whenever you receive a notification. If you wanted the notification vibration to be just a little bit weaker or just a little bit stronger, you're going to come here and adjust this slider. And then lastly, we have a slider for the touch feedback. And this is going to be anything from touching the user interface or even keypads. And again, we can just adjust this by using the slider right there. You can even disable vibration entirely by sliding these all the way down to the left. So you can see we're able to disable vibration entirely for say the phone ringing by just bringing this down like that same is said for notifications if we did not want our phone to vibrate whenever we received a notification we just bring that slider all the way to the left and that wraps up today's video on the new vibration and haptics strength sliders that are available starting with Android 12L and carrying over to the Android 13 developer preview as well.